Okay, welcome back to our first peer demo of the Autotask environment. So what we have to first do is actually configure Autotask to have the peer extension with it. So what you're going to do is find your way to learn.peer.ai, which if you're already onboarded, I'm sure that we've already ran you through this and familiarized yourself with this actual website. But I may as well just make a tutorial just so that we can uh, do it together. So you'll come to this website here, which we've given you access to. And then we will go straight to the implementation and onboarding. You can come here, scroll down, and we see Autotask Peer Extension. You can click on that tab. And then from here, we get a few uh, instructional methods on how to actually install it. But the easiest one for Microsoft Edge is install peer extension from Edge Store. We can click that. It'll take us to the Edge add-ons. We can select Get, Add Extension, there we go. Now it's been added to my Edge profile. You can see right here. So now if we head back to Autotask, open one of the tickets. Oh, I have to refresh first. There we go. Then we open it up. We will now see set up server address. So right here is where you're going to use, uh, you're going to specify the actual um, tenant that we're going to be running through. So for mine, I believe it'll be HTTPS demo at dot uh, peer .ai. And then if I update that, we can click here to start using it, and there we go. Just like that, mine's worked. So to find out what your um, server address is going to be, it's usually going to be the company name um, .peer.ai, I believe. Um, so similar to example, if it's example company, your uh, address would be example company .peer.ai. And through there, you can then run it. And that should then, uh, let me find it, successfully set up peer. Through here, you can start navigating through packages. You'll see it in a second, all the data will load. And there we go. Here is now set up for Autotask.